the tuner back. It gives them access to everything Cree locked down. What a mess. Leaking pipes, exposed wires, a recipe for disaster. I guess this will need reporting in. Then documenting, noting, logging. A lot of bureaucracy. Perfect job for a B1. Maintenance path should get us topside, I think. Just there. Sorry, old droid, but I promise you're gonna live on. It's okay, but for now we have to go it alone. Maybe we can get to that turbo lift now. unparalleled but sending a droid instead of facing me yourself such cowardice a small price to pay for her sparing your life tell me did the Jedi's death satisfy you he escaped all those years of incarceration dull your edge 
Sharp enough to see the Jedi might be your equal. Say it again and I'll cut out your tongue. It'll grow back. <laughs> Dagon, listen. The Jedi is a threat. Not now that we have this. I already duplicated the device's frequencies. We can now access any site she sealed. Well done, Ravis. You, activate the forest array. Go to the Shattered Moon. I know where Centauri hid the last compass. Dagon. After you have it, I will consider my oath to you fulfilled. What then, old friend? The galaxy has changed. There are many wars, but little honor to be won from them. Once we are on Tantalor, perhaps we can dream up a new war. You and I. <laughs> perhaps. Before I go, do you want me to scrap the droid? No. Centauri must have purged the droid's memory bank. Has no knowledge of the compass. I will tear it down to the bolts and reprogram it to serve me as it once served her. Oh, nice. Escape pods. Might come in handy. Dagon could be anywhere. Ready, BD? If you're ready, I'm ready. See, let's get you out of there. Do hurry, Cal. He's going to reprogram me. That droid is mine. I suppose I'll rescue myself. So you survived Ravis. How? The usual. You murdered your fellow Jedi. I struck down those who stood against me. Leave us or share their fate. Even if you believe the Council betrayed you, they were still your family. How arrogant that you would presume to know what drives me. What I can see is your obsession with Tantalor has blinded you. Whatever happened, you can't change the past. Trust me on that one. Perhaps you're right. The past is a chain. I must sever it completely! The tuner is mine! The droid is 
of my time. Anyone who stands in my way. Try harder. How dare you? So you have some ability. Friendly as ever. You've delayed me long enough. <laughs> You're not getting away that easy. Thanks. Two warriors at the height of their powers bound in brotherhood. This is the sub of legends. See. I got her. Meet you up there. Let's keep moving. Perhaps that's wise. Daddy Gary is positively mad. He kept going on and on about some compass. Your master created them to navigate the abyss. This is the first I'm hearing about it. She purged that knowledge from your memory. That would explain it. Well, Dagon is certain that she left a compass for him to find. Let's hope so. Dagon sent Ravis to check out another array on the moon. Maybe we'll find it there. Back to the moon. Great. Oh, Master Kree, why did you send me to free that traitor? People are complicated. Maybe she thought the Order got it wrong. 
only we could ask her. Please let us leave this dreadful place. Save us way out of here. You sure about that? No. Okay then. You seem nervous. I'm going with him. Hop aboard, Z. See you at the outpost. Yep, I'm coming. Never do that again. Dagon must have sent Ravis to get the compass. Maybe the forest array powers something on the moon. Uh, it's a guess. But if Ravis is on his way there, that's where we need to be too. You're on a roll, pal. Got another tip for ya. What you got? A bounty droid named Mesh has been babbling on the brood comms about that lab on the Shattered Moon. Go shut him up, will ya? They're a disgrace to the profession, if you ask me. We'll see about him. Sooner or later. Atta boy. You two getting your fortune read? I'm trying to. Uh, but we can't get a straight answer out of this one. Say it again, will you? On shores of silt, a river winds. A bank of guilt, a broken bind. Oh, I get it now. She's saying there's a big score to be had in some silty river. Ah, uh, you only hear what you want to hear. Sounded like a warning to me. One of them ominous ones. What do you make of it, Cal? It's dangerous out there. I trust my own instincts over a fortune. See? Kid gets it. Whoever made the score of a lifetime by being more careful? Hey, Monk. What can I do for you? Now, I know you've got a lot on your plate, but one of my patrons set off to the swamp, and no one's seen her since. You don't think she went after Z, do you? Quite likely. And we both know that's Raider territory. I'll check it out. That'll put us all at ease, Cal. Zig's one of the good ones. Cal, there you are. Both told me everything. Both pistols blazing, a real crack shot, straight out of the holiday. <laughs> Easy, Captain. Just trying to debrief. Debrief? Ooh, you hear that? This guy's a pro. How come we never debrief, Cal? Simmer down. You enjoying the spotlight, boat? Hmm, like an Imperial Cavity search. But I've got to admit, it's great to see everyone excited. Well, you know, when you first walked in here, I was getting ready to throw you out. Oh, funny. I remember asking myself, am I going to be the guy who gives this Lutero his second prosthetic arm? Oh, yeah, you go ahead and try. <laughs> Seriously. You've done good by us. Watch it out for you. It's like you're... Tears in your eyes, Grace? No, no, they're not tears. What are you kidding me? No. Probably smoke or something. Someone smoking in here? No smoking! I got it, Grace. Right back at you. And if you ever want to get that arm modded, I know a guy. You got an arm guy? Oh, yeah. Huh. Let me think about it. Get 
to it. Look at this. Plant them and ask Peely for info. over here. Quick shimmy, huh? Like to see her try to... What the? Oh! Damn it, Dainey! You're trying to make a crater out of my blasted head? Check it out, BD. Prior right. Ah, uh, but I'm the commander. I should be directing from the rear, right? Listen, Tin Can. I ain't giving my life for some stinking boy, got it?
yours for the taking battle. Something about you, something different. Nothing I'm going to tell you. Oh, an air of confidence, perhaps. Or is it arrogance? <laughs> Hiding behind that door? Hiding? No, no, just observing. That's what I do. Watch and wait. What for? For wanderers like you. Yeah. <laughs> 